All right, I'm heading to Lowe's to look for a um, refrigerator. So, let's see if I can find one. I want a refrigerator freezer. I want it to be 249 or less, and I want it to be at least four cubics. So, I saw one. Well, I don't know if they're carrying it here. Oh, well, here we go. There's no carts. Oh, we'll go check first. There we go. This is where they keep them. Seriously, I just saw one for $6.49. That was a big one. Wine cooler. No, no, no. None of these are what I'm looking for. Okay, this is more. All right, here's one. $2.49. Just a little one. I don't need it to have that much in it. Just enough so my guests can put a little bit of stuff in there and so that I can have a little, um, this is exactly what I want. I can put a little bit of ice cream in there for them. This one, oh, this is just a fridge for $189. I don't think it has a freezer. I want a freezer and Oh, this is 159. No freezer. That looks like the only one that has a freezer. So I guess that's it. When Tom returns his stuff, I'll have him pick this up and lug it out. Yay. That was easy. One choice. Is this the same one? 3.1 cubic feet. I guess that's big enough. 3.3. That's interesting. Oh. 3.3. Oh, here's a bigger one. Oh. That's even nicer. That's 279 instead of 249. It's a lot bigger and it has... Do I need bigger? No, but 30 bucks, I could get a bigger one. I think this one is black. I want a black one. Yeah, we'll get this one, it's black. We just, bought, we just brought Dewey to the groomer and it's, I don't know what time it is now, 2.30. And we returned the rest, the leftover that we had for the ceiling and we bought the refrigerator. Now we're heading home again. We're keeping the refrigerator upright so we can plug it in. Uh, can't plug it in if you put it, whoops. Well, now this is what our yard looks like today. What's going to look like when they come? <laughs> Tom says it's going to look like this when they come. Yeah. It looks like a whole dump. Yeah, the room's not even nice yet. Oh, boy. All right, let's see what we have going on here. Here we are. That's a very big step there. The dolly that takes longer to need your drag. <sighs> I wanted to get a water thing too, but Tom kiboshed it. We were a huge hotel, making huge money. Oh. Okay. If we were 
a huge hotel making huge money, he would concede that we could get the $159 water bin. Um, I think it's a good idea because it'll give us cold and hot. And it'll be good for the guests. They can get tea on a hot morning, cold morning. I think it's a great idea. Actually, maybe I shouldn't have asked and I should have just done now that I think about it. <sighs> this is it, guys. Not exactly ready for people yet. But it's not three o'clock yet. Um, got a few hours. It's going to take Tom forever to clean up outside. And I'll be working on the inside. And then he'll help me with a few things when he can take a break. I don't know about this. The room looks better than it did. Our yard looks bad, but the room looks good. I know it will. I know. No one even doubts that you're a hard worker, honey. Like I always say, I couldn't do this without you. We do. You couldn't do it without me either. Well, I need you to be the boss and tell me I'm doing things right. Exactly. Someone has to oversee the project. Yeah. Exactly. Exactly. What's the project without the project community? I am the project manager. Space or something. No, it's, a cover for it's a cover. All right. I think right now this could go right here on this wall since we don't have our uh, heater. Where do you want it? Right there where the garbage is. Or we can put it, where's the other outlet? I thought we could put it here too. Where would you like to see it? I don't okay, I want it here then. Let's forget where the garbage is. Now, I changed my mind. Let's put it here.
Yeah, that's nice. Can I let you set it up while I do other things? Yeah, yeah, I can set that up. Can you just put that microwave on top of it for me? Okay. It's right there. Perfect. Thank you, honey. You're welcome. All right. Tom is cleaning up the yard. Boy, it looks a lot better already. Oh man. I've got this little Euro thing, Euro, whatever they call it. And I'm gonna find a place to plug it in. A place where there aren't any bats, because I don't want bats pooping on it. Um so that'll be a trick. Hmm. This actually looks like as good as place as any. Maybe if I go here, they'll poop on the, yeah, here. All right, Tom is outside. Do I sound out of breath? I am, I am running. I am running. Okay, we need our bear there. I need to hang a picture there. I need different rugs here because I hate those colors. They're bothering me. Tom has to do the Luan on there instead of that board, which I have literally tripped on 15 times once, almost gashing my foot open. Um, I bought this last weekend when we were on vacation. I bought this at Shelburne Museum, and I love it. It's perfect. I'm so happy with it. So that's gonna go right over the bed. And once I get that hung, I'm gonna make the bed, got a new mattress cover, have my sheets and everything all washed. Uh, we're gonna put a bench here. I wanted to put our, I have a bench I wanted to put here, but I felt like it wasn't gonna fit. Now that I'm looking though, I think it might fit. So I'm gonna have Tom bring that over. Uh, it's just the black, um, I think it'll fit or or I could swivel that couch around and have it facing this way and then definitely that bench will fit however then that'll be in the way oh boy okay the flag went up I had two antlers I put one up on the curb just two weeks ago such a dummy I just I did um so that's that whatever uh, and this is looking pretty good, but there's a table that has to go here, over here. Tom still has to hang the curtain rods for me. We don't have a pellet stove, so we're going to just put a little, little space heater in here that looks like a fireplace so they can have a little romance if they want it. And, uh, I'm going to get a wicker chair from the other room to go there. So, yeah, it's coming along. We still have to do the bathroom door. We still have to put the bathroom light up. Um, we still have to run the hose, put in the shower, but the grass needed mowing so badly. So that had to happen. Yeah, maybe I'm gonna switch this around. Let's see. Do, 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 oh yeah, you're so cute. Oh, you're so cute. Smells really good too. Oh, he smells so good. I got a new doggy cologne in for the summer and it smells great. Oh. Such a handsome little boy. Handsome boy. Such a yeah. Handsome, boy. Sure you do. handsome boy. Handsome. Oh. How's mama's handsome boy? Yeah. Actually, he kind of matches mama. Oh, yeah. yeah. I feel like oh, someone yo. should take a picture. Well, come on. I'll video it. Yeah, she's so cute. <laughs> Come 
honey. We're gonna have to take a video together so we can match. And proof oh. that you actually have a bandana on you. Oh, you're so cute. You're so cute. Oh, let me take a picture. Put a dimmer switch on that switch so that it doesn't have to be 100% bright in here. You know what? That's a really good idea. That's a good idea. Yeah. yeah. It's a little intense in here. It is intense. It is. It's too bright. It's way too bright. Yeah. Yeah. Now, I mean, the good thing is, if we're not using the overhead lights, now we do have lights in here. Okay. And this is so cozy. Uh, okay. Well, isn't it? It is really cozy. I like this. It's cozy and pretty. Yeah, I'd like that better. Me too. I'm not big on lights. No, you don't need bright light. <laughs> you don't need bright light. No. So. And there are a couple, and this is more romantic. Like those two lights aren't going to, those two lights only operate, though, with the overhead. On those two because they're on that same circuit. They're on that same circuit. circuit. That yeah, so the only lights that we have that aren't on there are these four. Hey, I think the room for the most part is done. It's done for now. We'll have a phase two, but for now it's done. Tom is vacuuming out the barn and then he has to set up the shower. They'll be here in an hour. Um, we have our groceries. We're gonna have to cook, set up the massage table. But aside from that, I think we're pretty ready. Um, I tell you, this is a lot of work for two old people. Uh, this was just like building a house the day before people move in without a building team. And um, we're exhausted. I mean, we're absolutely exhausted, but we're running. I'm not even running on adrenaline anymore because I can't find my adrenaline. It's all gone. I'm just running up and down the hill. This, this is down the hill from the house, up and down the hill, up and down the hill, up and down the hill. <laughs> and I am just tired so um but let's take a look at the room okay okay here we are this is the room take it all in and i will walk you through what i did and where before our guests come and then it's not looking as picture perfect anymore all right, so if you walk in the room, this is what you see. We have these big lights. Of course, the chandeliers haven't sent shipped yet, so we're waiting on that, but those will look really cool when we get them, and we're gonna put it on a dimmer switch. This is what happens if you turn the lights off. You've got this darling, really cozy look, but we're gonna show it to you with the lights on. Let's start right around the corner. You come in and there's a picture painted by my grandpa. And of course we haven't been able to cover the outlets. That's going to take a little, but here's our refrigerator and our microwave. And I did go and leave some things for them. A couple teacups, a couple wine glasses and uh, tea. And I'm going to be putting ice cream and ice in their freezer. Coming over here, this is the worst part of the room, I think, because I hate that green plywood painted, but that is going to have the boards over it eventually. And I couldn't, I would have slopped that full of pictures, but that's a Luon and you cannot get a nail through the Luon. It's like impossible. So I couldn't slap it full of pictures. If I could, I would have, and that would have looked better. My settee, little sitting area. Now, everything in here, for the most part, I had in my house and or in the barn. So I brought in this table. It turned out to be too big for a lot of where I wanted to put it. But by angling it this way, it felt less obtrusive. And you guys have seen the seating area. We've got five hooks up there now. We have, this is just really cute. I was going to put a table in here, but we haven't gotten around to it. It doesn't really need a little coffee table. The 
bed is the center of the room and it is actually um, symmetrical because I have two of the same matching tables and two matching lamps. I did find all this bedding in my house and these are my yoga blankets that I actually still had in bags that I never used. And of course up there is the flag and the antlers. So uh, I think that looks really good. I'm actually really happy with that. I wanted something that would just make that bed seem a little more um, like a focal point in the room. And I think that those yoga blankets did a really good job of it. I love Mr. Moose behind it too. I love my Amish rocking chair. That's just perfect in this room. And then this beautiful seating area. So they can sit there and just talk and drink their wine. And then this side, we did get the curtains up finally. And of course, that will be done another time also. And the bathroom, which we didn't do. I ran out this morning and bought new towels because the towels were, uh, it's been a long time since we had people here. So we didn't have good towels. The toilet's all cleaned and ready with a bag in it. And I went out and bought some new things for the shower. So... The rugs that I used were the rugs I had in here. I was able to cover everything I needed to cover. And so for the most part, everything basically I had, except for that moose that I purchased last weekend and that little fish pillow and the curtains and the towels. Everything else are things that I had around the house, which now means that I have more room in the house because I've done a little more decluttering there and I really like this. All right, they're going to be here in a half hour. The wood's still in the barn. Tom swapped up the poop, but he has to clean the floor yet. That's crazy bats. I'm, I'm just at my wit's end with the bats. I'm at my wit's end. I just, you know, and now, of course, we have a, a, a squirrel family who, the nice squirrel just took a dump on my table. So, um, yeah, I, I, I hate poop. I hate it. And... And I'm just like, we have to seal this barn up. Every year that we don't seal this barn up is another disaster. Well, we're in the car. We're actually sitting down for the first time today. Um, <laughs> and we're heading out to the bakery to get some sourdough bread, muffins for breakfast, and then we have to head out to another place to get gluten-free muffins, head out to another place to get ice cream, and then we have to go to the grocery store and I guess Walmart because uh, we got to look for an umbrella. So that's on our docket and our esteemed guests are having massages, which sounds oh so good. Sometimes Gail gives me one <laughs> after everybody else, but I won't have time for that today. <laughs> um, anyway, here we go. At the light, turn left on the mass market road.
Nice day, dear. Yep. <laughs> that was a dump right over back there. Yep. So we got our umbrella. Would you believe a little beach umbrella is $37 at Ocean State, which is like the cheapest store in the world? Crazy. And uh, we got desserts. Gluten-free desserts, really pretty. And we got some muffins and stuff for breakfast. And for pre-breakfast. And then now we're heading out for this ice cream that's really good. Really, really good ice cream. I hope they have maple walnut. And here we are. We are lighting a fire because it's actually cold enough outside to put a fire in there. And we're gonna grill steak on there. I set up a nice little spot for the two of them for wine and water and um, they're gonna have a wonderful five course, seven course meal. How are you feeling, Tom? Mm. <laughs> that capture it? <laughs> I think so, but it went well. It did. Yes, it well. yes, your meal was amazing. Your steak was, and it was a combined meal. We did a good, we did a good job. We did a good job and the room looks great and the barn is was clean and they had the best massage ever in the barn. Oh, good. They were so happy. Good. So um, I think it all went great. Yep. And now we'll get up tomorrow morning and make brunch. Yep. And then we're off duty. Yep. And then it's Father's been, Day. We've been running all day from 7.30 in the morning till about a half hour ago. We have been. So... So we're going to sign off, guys. Thanks for watching our, our, our uh, what would we call this? Adventure. Adventure. Yay.